struggle with your weight, with your energy, and even mental clarity, even though you're doing all the seemingly right stuff, like exercising regularly, eating world's healthiest foods, and maybe even intermittent fasting. If this sounds like you, first know that you are not alone. And this is exactly what I want to talk today about and why this strategy doesn't work, especially for midlife females. I'm Charlene Stiles. I'm a holistic nutritionist, and I specialize in helping midlife women boost their metabolism, balance their hormones, and their weight. Today, I want to share my unique and holistic approach that involves addressing what I call the triple threat, and that is addressing inflammation, digestion, and hormones at the same time. You see, all of these key functions, even though they may seem like they're independent, they are all so interconnected and interdependent on each other. That means that when one area is off, it affects the others. So if your digestion is impaired, you have inflammation. And if you have inflammation, your body's hormone signals are jammed up or muffled. Those signals are off. So in this video, I'd like to share with you that how we can address all three of these at the same time will help you with not, not only your overall health and well-being, but to help you achieve weight loss goals and feel your best. So first, let's take a look at the state of your gut or the state of your digestive ability. You may know that digestion plays a really critical role in not only our health, but predominantly our metabolism. So when you eat, your body breaks down food into basic usable components like nutrients and energy. And if your digestion is impaired, your body is not able to break down and utilize those basic components that it needs to function the most optimally, get the nutrients, get the energy that it needs from the food. That's the reason that we actually eat food. So this can lead to not only a slower metabolism, but it can cause the body to hold on to excess calories, leading to even more weight gain. And when digestion is impaired, it causes inflammation in the gut. A much deeper topic, but just on a high level. So this can also further slow down our metabolism and continue to contribute to weight gain. So... The next phase to look at is inflammation. So you may already know that you have inflammation in your body based on some symptoms. Some common symptoms of, of inflammation that you may be aware of would be uh, stiffness in your joints or pain in your joints, fatigue or low energy, brain fog, digestive issues like bloating, gas, or constipation, skin issues like rashes, eczema, uh, psoriasis, even allergies and asthma, or mood swings, so depression, anxiety, mental clarity and acuity being off, brain fog, difficulty uh, concentrating. You can also have potential menstrual irregularities or painful periods. And of course, weight gain or difficulty losing weight. These are all common symptoms of inflammation that's already circulating in your body. So if these symptoms sound familiar, you can bet you have inflammation. However, I can understand your question may be, well, how did that even start? How did I get inflammation? And while that may be on the scope of this video today, on a very high level, their inflammation could be triggered by a number of different factors like stress, uh, poor diet, deficiency in particular nutrients or excesses in particular toxins, uh, lack of exercise, and even hormonal changes. In midlife women, particularly, hormone changes um, like fluctuations in our estrogen and progesterone levels can contribute to even more inflammation. And as women age, their bodies become less efficient in fighting inflammation, making them even more susceptible to chronic and long-lasting inflammation. So when we have 
exposure to long-term or chronic inflammation, this can lead to a whole host of health issues, including weight gain, hormone, even more hormone imbalances, and an increased risk of chronic diseases. So you see, this is how the cycle, cycle keeps going, how it keeps feeding the loop over and over and over again. So impaired digestion triggers inflammation. Inflammation then leads to either, even further hormone imbalances, which, which causes even more digestive issues, and the cycle continues. So the key to breaking the cycle is simply not to, to just address the hormonal is issues or changes or even your inflammatory issues or the symptoms of inflammation or even worse, just revert to a very strict diet and rigorous exercise routine, those will not solve the problem. Instead, it's essential to take a holistic approach that addresses all of the causes of all of the processes that we just talked about at the same time. So we need to address this triad of inflammation, digestions, and hormone imbalances together simultaneously. By addressing all of these factors together, we can optimize your metabolism, balance your hormones, shed stubborn weight, and enhance your overall health and well being. So now that you've learned about this triple threat, what I've coined the triple threat, this is my holistic approach to boosting your metabolism. I'd like to offer you a free guide if you want to take it a step further and you can learn even more tips and tricks about how to boost your own metabolism naturally and achieve your weight loss goals if that's what you're after. You can click the link in the description below and download your free metabolism boosting guide now. And in the next video, I'm going to dive a little bit deeper into the role of anti-inflammatory foods so that we can know how we can boost our metabolism from that regard. So be sure to subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell so you don't miss it. And I'll see you in the next video.